Several recent criminal abuse investigations are showing how domestic violence and child abuse are affecting tri-staters every day. Well, the Vandenberg County Sheriff's Office says from January to June of 2023, they recorded 184 domestic violence and child abuse cases. Then this year in 2024, from January to June 26th, there were 195 cases. Now this is more than a 5% increase. The growing number of cases in the county calls for awareness and resources available for victims. Evansville is home to two centers that can help. Eyewitness News' Emily Blackmar has more tonight on the resources available in Vanderburg County. Domestic violence doesn't discriminate. It affects people of all ages, all races, all genders, and all economic groups. They say about one out of every four women and about one out of every seven men experience domestic violence at some point in their lifetime. The Albion Fellows Bacon Center is a shelter serving victims of domestic violence and sexual assault. Executive Director Gina Gist says they're hearing of many more violent cases and more cases with children. Children who grew up in abusive homes, whether they're being abused or not, are greatly affected by the violence they witness. Albion is full during the summer, seeing more children than adults. Guess says most people focus on the adult, not thinking how a child is affected. It's just heartbreaking that you think these kids growing up in these homes, witnessing this abuse all the time, wondering, am I going to be hurt? Is mom going to be hurt? Or is dad going to be hurt? Holly's house also provides support for child and adult victims emphasizing the growing need for resources. Over the last few years, we've seen a 270% increase in child abuse cases that have been reported and escalated to investigation at Holly's house. And last year, that number um, grew by 20%. Executive Director Christine Court says kids are impacted by domestic violence and how they perceive violence. The impact can be long lasting. Domestic violence for children definitely changes the way their brains think. Um, and we talk about the trauma and its long-term impact. Despite the recent cases of child abuse and domestic violence, Holly's House says there's a call to action for adults in the state of Indiana. It's important um, that you follow through with a child. If a child is in your care, um, that they understand that they didn't do anything wrong for something like this to happen to them and that we believe them and we're going to get them help. In Vanderburg County, Emily Blackmar, Eyewitness News.